In this video, we'll learn how to test a raw black diamond at home, step by step, using simple tools you already have. First, let's understand what a black diamond really is. Black diamonds, also called carbonado, are among the toughest and most mysterious gemstones on Earth. Their surface is dark, porous, and they don't sparkle like white diamonds. Because of their rough texture, testing them requires different methods than testing clear diamonds. Let's begin the first test. The scratch test. Take a piece of glass or a mirror. Gently scratch it with the edge of your stone. If your stone leaves a visible scratch line without being damaged itself, it might be diamond. Black diamonds are harder than glass. Glass has a hardness of about 5.5, while diamond is 10 on the Mohs scale. Remember, always be gentle and don't use too much force. Now, move to the second test, the heat test. Hold your stone with tweezers and heat it with a lighter for about 30 to 40 seconds, then drop it immediately into cold water. A real diamond will not break or crack because it resists sudden temperature changes. Fake stones or crystals will likely shatter or lose color. The third test is the water density test. Fill a glass with normal water and drop your stone inside. Diamonds have high density and will sink quickly to the bottom. If it floats or stays suspended, it's not a real diamond. Next, try the light reflection test. Shine a bright light or use your phone's flashlight. A genuine black diamond does not sparkle like white diamonds. Instead, it reflects light in a metallic or glossy way, often with silver or graphite-like reflections. If it looks glassy or rainbow-like, it's probably a fake. Now let's do the magnet test. Black diamonds are made mostly of carbon, so they should not react to a magnet. If your stone is attracted to a magnet, it may contain a high amount of metal or iron, which means it's not a pure diamond. The fifth method is using a diamond tester device. If you have one, place the probe on the surface of the stone. Real diamonds conduct heat very well, so the tester will indicate diamond. Make sure your stone and the tester are clean before trying this. Another trick is the sandpaper test. Use rough sandpaper and gently rub it on your stone. A real diamond will not scratch easily, while fake stones will show visible damage almost immediately. Finally, observe the texture and structure. Raw black diamonds are usually not shiny. They look rough, irregular, and covered with tiny pits or holes. They feel very hard and cold to the touch. Under a magnifying glass, you'll see a unique granular surface, something no other gemstone truly has. If you pass several of these tests successfully, there's a good chance you have a genuine black diamond. But remember, for 100% confirmation, take it to a certified gemologist who can perform advanced tests like infrared spectroscopy or x-ray diffraction. At home, these simple tests can help you get close to the truth without needing expensive equipment.